you know what we have recreated this app so if you long press on any item then it selects that item and we can delete that item from here so in this video i'm gonna show you a different way to delete an item so that's like if you swipe the item from right to left it will delete that it's actually pretty easy to implement in android the first thing i need to create one class here right click new kotlin class 5 so i'm gonna give the name as swipe to delete callback swipe to delete callback and this class should be of abstract type so we will extend it from item touch helper dot simple callback the first is uh, it's drag direction so we are not implementing drag we'll do that only with this swipe to delete so this is zero and the next one is the swipe direction so it is item touch helper dot left that means it will delete the item if we swipe from right to left so here we need to override one function it's called on move and we will return false from this function next thing we need to do is in our main activity whenever we are creating the adapter we need to assign this swipe to delete callback to the recycler view so here we are creating the adapter the first thing i'm going to do i'm going to create this swipe uh, one swipe to delete callback so let me give the name as swipe delete it's a, it's a object of type swipe to delete callback and here we need to override one function it's called on swipe so once uh, we can swipe one item like from right to left then we will delete that item from the adapter so here we will call this my adapter dot delete item so we need to pass the index and we can get it from the view order that we are getting in this function so view order dot error position so we can call this method so let me uncomment these lines and it will delete that item the next thing we need to create one item touch helper object so let me Name it as touch helper and equal to item touch helper. And here I'm gonna pass this swipe to it. Now we can attach this touch helper to the recycler view. Attach to recycler view, that's our recycler view. Another thing we need to do is to implement another function here. It's called on child draw. We can start it. We need to put it as this at the three second view because we are using this inside this apply and now if i just left swipe it then you can see that it's deleting that item so we can also show one icon here so if i'm like swiping it then you can show one delete icon here that uh, with one background color so for that we need to pass the context to this swipe delete call here. So here I'll pass this context and 
how you use one library it's called a sector key swipe decorator which makes it simpler to say add one icon to the right or left and also we can add the fonts and the background color it's really easy to use otherwise it uh, takes some time to implement it so this is the implementation that we need to put in the kernel file It's a small library, but it comes in handy. You know, like you don't have to reinvent the wheel again. Mm -hmm. Now, in Google, this is the basic of how we can uh, use this library. So we need to put this inside this on child draw. So let me copy it. Then here we have this on child draw method. Then I'm pasting it. It's in Java, so I'm converting it into Kotlin. Then we need to pass one icon here. Let me pass this IC delete. Make sure that it's not importing this Android R. So it is importing this delete button that we already have. Then let me create the color. I'm gonna cut it and Since we are passing the context here, we can get the color here. Background color equal to. We need to pass the context as a first parameter, and here let me add one new color, or let me add the color second accent for now. We can also create one new color here. Let me create a new color. Color to set value. Delete. I press Alt and Enter, then it shows me that create color video resource color set value delete. So here I'm gonna give it a color like uh, it's red. Okay, okay. Then we can put this color here. Now let me restart it. Now, if I swipe one icon, then you can see that it's showing this new button and the color. This library provides a couple of uh, different methods, so you can go through the uh, documentation or you can check these methods that are available. But you can also add levels and also like since the font size of the level type and also you can add different types of icon type for swipe right and swipe left. So that's all for today. I hope that you learned how we can get this swipe with lip in Android. And if you love this video, please drop and comment and please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye.